Welcome dear friends. This is a question from board exam CBSE Delhi Circle 2013. Question is from electrostatics. Question goes like this. A hollow cylinder cylindrical box of length 1 meter and area of cross section 25 centimeter square is placed in three dimensional coordinate system as shown in the figure. So this is a cylindrical box whose axis is along x axis. The electric field in the region is given by a vector E equal to 50 x i cap. So i cap means direction is along positive x axis and electric field varies with x coordinate that means as x keeps on increasing the strength of the electric field also keeps on increasing. So, where E is in Newton per coulomb, already in SI units, but area is not in SI units, we have to change it. So, first most job in solving a numerical is to change the units, where X is in meter. So, find number one, net flux through the cylinder, number two, charge enclosed by the cylinder. So, let's proceed. First of all, Let's mark uh, these areas. Let me name this side as left hand side, this one as right hand side. The area vector of plane part, flat part of the cylinder is along negative x axis as area points uh, away from the volume of the given Gaussian surface. So, SL would point along negative x axis. Area in size would be 25 centimeter square ko change karna hai into meter square. So you will have to divide by 10,000. Same way on the right hand side, area would be pointing towards positive x axis. Area of course is same. And electric field, as is uh, given in the question, electric field is along positive x axis i cap. So it is along positive x axis here and it is along positive x axis here too but as x keeps on increasing strength of electric field would keep on increasing that means this electric field e left is lesser as x coordinate is smaller whereas e on at right hand side would be larger so let's go let's go for solving for electric flux since electric flux is given by e dot area so Curved surface, if I draw any surface area over here, like you have gone through a derivation, electric field due to a uniformly charged line, the direction of electric field was away from the charge in that case. So we have drawn an area here, curved surface area, small area here, that was pointing uh, along positive y axis. Since electric field is along x axis, area is pointing along y axis, angle between E and ds would be 90 degree so electric flux would be zero to the curved surface area of the cylinder everywhere so now we are left with flat surfaces left one and right one only so flux on left hand side would be electric field is pointing along positive x axis 50 into x coordinate 1 into i cap it is to be dotted with area Area in magnitude is 25 divided by 10,000 gives 0 0.0025. Direction is along negative x axis, hence minus i cap. i cap dotted with i cap is 1, and rest we are left with 50 into 0 0.025 into minus 1, that is equal to minus 0.125 volt meter. Now let us come to right hand side. On right hand side, E and area vector both are pointing in the same direction. So, you may directly write 50 into x coordinate 1 plus 1 equal to 2 meter. So, x equal to 2 meter, i cap. Area vector, magnitude is same, but direction is long, positive x axis. So, i cap. i cap dot i cap is 1. So, answer would be exactly double of this, but there is no negative sign this time. That means answer is going to be positive. Simply add these two, you would get the net, net flux. So first part is over. Net electric flux through the cylinder is 0.125 volt meter. 
let's come to second part second part is what is the charge enclosed by the cylinder so according to gauss's theorem i have written in short according to gauss's theorem net flux equals charge enclosed by epsilon not but charge enclosed is 0.125 so multiply this side with epsilon not value of epsilon not would be given in the question paper if you are able to mug it up then better otherwise copy it from the question paper 8.854 into 10 power minus 12 and on removing this decimal i will get 1000 below in the denominator 125 cancels with 1000 as 8 so 1 by 8 of 8.54 into 10 power minus 12 coulomb is the charge enclosed now there is an exercise based on a similar type of question which we have got in year 2019 that is supplementary exam 16 july 2019 so just go through it here again you have an electric field along x-axis but it is 200 newton per coulomb along i cap for values of x greater than zero right hand side and e is minus 200 i cap newton per coulomb for values of x less than zero that is left hand side again a right circle cylinder of length 30 centimeter length is 30 and radius 5 centimeter radius is 5 centimeter that means area is again 25 centimeter square lies parallel to x axis similar situation just this cylinder is to be shifted so that the center of the cylinder lies at the origin so center lies at origin shift this cylinder to this point so that left face lies in the negative region right face lies in the positive region and i hope you would be able to solve it further and the answer is already given 3.14 volt meter if you are able to do it yourself that means i have succeeded in my mission so if you have understood completely please do like the video share with other others and subscribe the channel for further updates thank you for watching